Hi, 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 and welcome back. Today we are going to learn about Boundary Balls Base Future Command Manager commands that they are similar to Lufted Balls Base, but we'll see the difference. Open your SolidWorks document. Okay, and start new sketch on front plane. Right click, sketch. We'll use polygon command. We'll draw one triangle somewhere here. It has to be 70 millimeters and make this line horizontal. So when we click on the line, we get relation properties in line properties on the left side of the screen. And uh, in relation, we'll add horizontal relation to this line. I want it to be horizontal on my screen. Add dimension 55. I will add one more relation. So click on this point, hold control on keyboard, click on other point, on origin point, and again horizontal. Exit the sketch. And now draw on the right plane. So right click on right plane, plane and sketch. Here we will draw one circle. It will be 40 millimeters. Also, it has to be in horizontal plane and it will be 100 millimeters far away from the origin point. Exit the sketch and go extrude both base in future point manager. Extrude it 45 millimeters. Okay. Again, sketch one, extrude it, change direction 45 millimeters again. Okay. And now we will use boundary both base. So to boundaries, we need two sketches or two faces or the sketch profile and direction for that sketch profile. So in first, we we'll go with this example. Go with boundary both ways. Use this face and this face. And in preview, we can see our new body. We can rotate the green points to get the right profile of our new body. And also, like in Lofted Ball Space, we have to add the directions. So we have normal to profile, direct vector, and tangency to face and others. I will use normal to profile. And here is our new profile. Next thing we will do a shell command point one millimeter. Use these two faces. And here is it. Okay. Exit again new document. And this time I will show you boundary bolt base with direction line. So new sketch on front plane polygon now Eight wraps will add up. We'll add this dimension to be 30 millimeters and this point and this point to be in horizontal. Exit the sketch. Now we'll draw one more line.
here is our new part exit this file again new document now we'll draw on uh, three planes we'll do something interesting so on the front plane we'll create two more planes just select front plane okay the first one will be 30 millimeters far away from the top plane and again create one new plane which will start from play one and it will be 70 millimeters far away from play one okay so here is our three planes right click to hide or show the the thing that you want so we will draw first in front plane i will add one circle here that is five millimeters so maybe five or ten millimeters eight is best then right click on plane one again sketch and again draw one more circle that is 50 millimeters and on sketch on plane two again sketch and draw one plane that will be 30 millimeters exit the sketch and again we'll use boundary both base but in this time we will pick all our sketches and here is our profile with green point we can change the look of our profile we can modify it. this one will be normal to profile down will be also normal to profile and in the middle known so here is our kind of uh, i for or q for uh, hold control select the three lines and show all height uh, use shell command shell point one millimeters again and just this face click ok and here is our vase for flowers we can add color on it appearance boundary uh, red or yellow no uh, yellow is better just floors are missing <laughs> thanks for watching subscribe and see you in next video